Okay, I am gonna be perfectly safe. It's a wedding. All of the guests are people we know. And it will be my privilege to make absolutely certain that nothing bad happens. You have my word that if you entrust Kelly to my care, I will bring her home safe and sound. I don't need your word because I've got this. What's that? My invitation to the wedding. The commissioner sent it. So, whenever you're ready. What is this? Was everybody invited to the stupid wedding except me and the sound? Huh? Why? You think it might have something to do with what happened at Nora's last wedding? Oh, come on. I had a couple of adult beverages. I... It's a wedding. People are supposed to celebrate. Okay, whatever. And you know what? I thought you, of all people, wouldn't judge me. Well, Blair, I'm not judging you. you. You asked me why, and I was trying to come up wait, with... Wait, wait, wait. All right, and back it up here, counselor. If you got this invitation, what, a couple of weeks ago, were you going to invite me to be your date? Well, I didn't think you'd want to go. Well, I don't. But John practically got down on his hands and knees to beg me. I couldn't, I couldn't say no. Well, that's very sporting of you. I would be honored to be your date. You would? Blair, there's something you need to know about me. What? I never turned down an opportunity to stand next to the most beautiful woman in the room. Oh, you are so sweet. Mm. Uh oh. <clears throat> Passing through. Well, we're just kind of getting in the mood for a Bonor's wedding. Oh, well, that's a coincidence. We were just talking about that ourselves. Um, Reed, this is my cousin Blair Kramer and Elijah Clark. Clark. Hi. Yes. Reed Wagner. How are you? Nice to meet you. Likewise. Oh, I'm detecting a little accent there. Kind of reminds us of our old friend, right? Ian Armitage. Don't try and kill this one, Kelly. Like you did with Max? Excuse me? Nothing. Since we're heading in the same direction, why don't we all go together? <laughs> I don't know. We kill it. Uh, we, we don't really do double dating. Well, there is always a first time for everything. That is, if you can stand it. I guess I could. Well, what do you know? They say weddings bring out the magic. I guess I just saw some. Okay. I gave Charlie the garment bag, and he's going to give it to Bo, and he will have it in no time. What's wrong, Ed? I thought I'd be like the first time. Are you kidding? You are going to look even better. I'm going to look out of one eye. That's how I'm going to look. Unless I get this tooth fixed, I'm going to be loving Bo in thickness and in health. Don't worry about that. It's barely even noticeable. And the patch and the crutch? Oh, yeah, that's every bride's dream accessory. Well, maybe the girl's got a point. You know what they say, three strikes, you're out. Rocks. Well, you know, sometimes when so many bad things happen, you gotta take it kind of like a sign. Not today. Today, we're going to be positive. Yeah, I mean, we found the perfect dress, didn't we? Mm -hmm. And you fixed your hair, mm -hmm. and as soon as Jessica finds the dentist, we'll fix that too. And you know what? I'm gonna call her right now and see how she's doing. Good. I hope she's all right driving around in this deluge. Jess, where are you? Did you find a dentist? Awesome. Okay, great. We'll see you soon. She found someone, they're on their way. Hey, Nora, did you hear that? She found a dentist, they're on their way, they'll be here in a minute. Everything's gonna be fine. I don't know about that, Vicky. I think Roxy's right. You know, sometimes there are signs you just can't ignore. I mean, let's face it. I've had more signs than you could stick it stick uh, more signs than you could stick. I've had a lot of signs. Don't you like it? No, I do. I do. Um, but it won't stay. It's just going to fall as soon as I start walking. Where are you walking to? I thought you had something to tell me. Yeah. Matthew, I just want you to know that... Hey, you guys. I need to get this to Bo right away. Oh, he's you... up in the rector. You know what? Actually, I should start getting ready, too. I'll, I'll take it to him. Okay. Oh, um, we can talk after the reception, okay? I promise. Hey. Everything okay? Fine. Look, Danny, I know nobody gives advice as good as your Aunt Vicky, but, I mean, I've learned a thing or two, so if you need to talk, you can give me a try. Thanks. That's really nice of you, but I'm okay. Um, just need to talk to Matthew about something. 
Okay, well, if you change your mind, just remember, Uncle Charlie's here. Thanks. Okay. Uh, is that what Gigi called about? She said Charlie was bringing something over. This is it? Hey, big brother, how'd you get in here? Hey, little brother. We call each other big brother and little brother. Isn't that cool? What do you mean? How did I get in here? I got my ways. Yeah, well, whatever you do, don't teach any of them to him. Dad, I've got great news. We've got the skunk smell out of the church. The spray cans finally kick in? Well, Brody here brought a couple million flowers, and I guess that did the trick. That's great. Now, what about me? Am I fit to be smelled in mixed company? I think you need a few more minutes. Oh, God. Oh, Laura's over there thinking everything is fine. She only knew. Bo's over there getting ready, thinking everything's fine, and he doesn't have a clue. But, honey, everything is fine. Oh. You're marrying the man you love doesn't get any finer. Oh, Jesse! Glad to see you. Oh, sorry that we took so long. Okay. Uh, your patient is right over there. <laughs> Hi. Hi. No offense, but you look uh, young to be a dentist. Is this the guy that Jackie recommended? Uh, no. He was in Bermuda. Okay. Um, and no one else would do a house call. So, everybody, um, this is Murray Ziddle. He is a dental student at LU. Oh, what year? Uh, finishing up my first. For, first, for, as it, first? Hey, first. give the kid a break. Uh, uh, well, I'm sorry, but uh, um, how many patients have you had? Well, we haven't worked on actual people yet, but there's a big section on broken teeth and emergency dentistry 102. Oh, that's perfect. I didn't look. Whoa, that is bad. Yeah, I, I know. Can you fix it? I, I don't think so. Oh, come on, you have to. Murray, you promised. I, you said that you would give it your best shot. You I, have to try. I thought I could, but I can't. I'm sorry. I, uh, okay, Murray, Murray, Murray Siddle. You listen to me and you listen to me right now. You can do this. You will do this. Uh, <laughs> now get cracking. <laughs> 